Well, buddy, good to see you. Last time we had a chat, we were in Liverpool. You were with Callum Smith. So you, your UK tour continues. We're in London now. So, obviously, now with the big man with Dylan and White. So, how's everything going? Everything's great, man. You know, I, just, I can't complain. Just waiting for Saturday night. I was saying, buddy, I saw some of the pad work you learned, you know, it was online. Dillian, you've trained a lot of good left hookers. Is Dillian right up there with them? Oh, well, without a doubt. But he's, you know, he's got thunder in both hands. Yeah. You know what I mean? But when he whips that hook, he whips it. Is it a real busy time for you, buddy, lately? I think Yannabet was on recently, wasn't yes. there? I know before that he was over in Abu Dhabi with Callum. Dillian on Saturday. Is this you till the end of the year now, or are you out again before Christmas? Uh, I believe December 17th, Dan Aziz. Oh, of course, yeah. Yeah, the, right. yeah, the box show in Bournemouth. Yeah, I don't... So the UK tour continues. <laughs> 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 And how is it working with the, with the likes of Dylan? We just saw that, you know, he can be fiery. He's got the, the loss that he's had to deal with as well to Tyson Fury. But do you feel that he's got a little bit of fire there, as we saw with that little flare-up after the I mean, press listen, conference? I mean, listen, I mean, I don't judge anybody. You know what I mean? I didn't even, I've never seen Dylan fight, if you want to know the truth. You know what I mean? And then the training camp, we didn't even talk about the Tyson Fury fight, not once. Never came up. You know what I mean? That's the pass, and I believe... When it's in the past, you leave it, you leave it there. If not, it'll catch up with you. So don't look back, as they would say. So uh, training camp has been good. He's had very good spawn. And um, I have no complaints. You know, if, if I would have seen anything at training camp that didn't look right, I wouldn't be standing here right now. I just want to bring Anthony in this, on this because your methods are quite, I suppose, unique in a way. You don't look at the fight. You don't know yeah. anything about Franklin. You've not watched any of <laughs> Dillian. It's, a, it's a, probably it's a unique way to train fighters. Is that fair to say, Am? Would you say yeah, that? Yeah, no, well? I, I was saying pretty so. As a young coach now, would you, do you, just, do you just focus on your fighter's strengths and obviously working on their weaknesses in general? I'll let the other guy worry about what we're going to yeah. do. I'm not going to sit back and study this guy. <laughs> i got better things to do with my time. <laughs> so what's the plan then with, with Dillian if he comes through? I mean, there's been a lot of talk about Anthony Joshua. Is that something that you'd be very happy about? Well, I, I never like to put the cart before the horse. Yeah. Yeah. So we can do this interview Sunday. <laughs> and they asked me the same question on Sunday. Right, we'll find a few more towns in the meantime yeah, where we okay, can be you continue around the UK. Good man. Sounds Thanks, good. Buddy. Thank, Thank you very nice much. Well.